Chinese youth are increasingly supporting vulnerable groups in Kenya. This is in line with China's 2020 Public Benefit Inter International Challenge for Youth. The contest challenges youth in Africa and China to come up with innovative ideas to tackle pressing issues in Africa. Tunza Africa is among the organizations looking to connect young Chinese with volunteer opportunities in Africa. Kenya's Children's Garden Home and School is one of Tunza's Africa's beneficiaries. Uh, gardens, Children's Garden Home and School caters for orphans as well as abused and neglected street children. Wilkista Nyabwa has more. His movements are smooth, economical, almost poetic. He moves like the wind. In a field of children playing and showcasing their talents, this teenager has no trouble standing out. With schools closed because of the COVID-19 pandemic, he, like the other children here, has found time to hone his skills. This is Children's Garden School and Home in Kawangware, on the outskirts of Nairobi. 19 years ago, Moses Ndongo founded the center, which is both a school and a home for about 450 disadvantaged children from the neighboring settlements. By then, 2001, uh, schools were not free, and we had a lot of street children who were just uh, rotating the streets. So that's when I came up and I thought I need to give back to the community, I need to support. And as the home grew, so did the children's needs. Today, apart from the children's dorms, it has expanded to include a primary school and high school section to enable the children to get a good education. I want these children to do well in the education. Because in Kenya, when you're educated, then you have a good life. When you are not educated, then you go back to the streets. But there aren't sufficient resources to meet all of the children's education needs. In primary, as we don't have textbooks, we only use, you can find that we have only one textbook for the teacher. And that one textbook is the only one that we will use the whole class. That's how Tunza Africa International Volunteers came in. Headquartered in Nairobi, Tunza Africa is an organization that connects Chinese youth and students who want to volunteer in African countries. Some have worked at Children's Garden Home, teaching music and song and martial arts and contributing to ongoing projects. They come and taught us some activities, games, and also they teach us Chinese. Whenever they come, uh, I, I see a lot of life because when I see them engaging, working together with our, with our youth, with our children, it's uh, really encouraging. Tunza has also donated books to the little school library, which the home is looking to expand. And as soon as things return to normal, the organization will sponsor its very first student at the school to study plant operations in college. Like being plant operators, some other kids here in the home, they'll be somehow happy about it and they will some of them will want to do it the center has grown plans for its pupils but these are at a standstill until the covid 19 pandemic ends but they remain with the memory of the new friends they have made a cultural exchange across two continents whose impact continues to be felt children's garden home acknowledges the importance of education in breaking the cycle of poverty and through donations of books and other materials volunteers and supporters are helping the children to work toward a better future wilkis anyabo cgtn in nairobi kenya